My name is Robin Hunter. I'm the CTO and co-founder of Romatech. Romatech is a smart energy solutions company. We work in conjunction with EV Energy and selected EV Energy as one of our critical partners because the software is really easy to use. It is also future-proof and allows us to be sure that the future requirements that are coming along in terms of EV charging will be met and it will also save energy, time and money for you as the user. The install with the EV Energy and the Easy One is really straightforward and the app is already configured so that the user, all they need to do is to open the app and log in and everything is there ready to use out of the box. My name is Kathleen and today I'm going to tell you a little bit more about the EV Energy app. Most charging apps and some vehicle apps will allow customers to schedule their charging to their utility off-peak windows. But what's different about the EV Energy platform is that it's constantly interacting with the grid, your energy provider and other charges and vehicles to make sure we're not putting unnecessary strain on the energy grid at any given time. Connecting to the EV Energy app means that we can guarantee to give you the cheapest and the greenest charge available when your car is plugged in. And because you allow us to do this, we want to give you something back. For every charge over 10 kilowatt hours, we will give you reward points that you can spend on a variety of retailers or you can choose to cash them in for carbon credits. You can also wirelessly connect your solar panels to align 100% renewable energy that's generated from your panels. The EV Energy app has two options. The first, you can actually choose to charge only when the sun is shining. And second, you can add your solar charging to align with your tariff and demand that's currently on the grid. So how do you get started? All we need to know is four very simple things. What car do you drive? what energy tariff you use, where you live, and when you need your car ready by. That's it.